I would appreciate it if no one mentioned food on here for at least the next 36 hours. I am such a sucker for pretty things, delicate things. I see this message more often than you would think. I hate boring convos that go nowhere. You can hate if you all want, but guess who still is live and a good lift? Put your neurotic self in perspective and maybe learn to leave things open. I just want a place to express my thoughts and have a little fun. I'm fine. I am totally enchanted by this adorable and intelligent woman. GRR. I know it's random and spam bots and stuff, but I am always all like, what did I say? I worry that I will change something and never know how to change it back. I haven't been able to post lately, but I am hoping to be more consistent from now on. I just hope I don't become so blissful I become boring. I think I will always be neurotic enough to do something weird. I look better with my glasses on. Actually, it's white and not egg blue. She is a self-proclaimed expert on room furnishings. What is that bucket hat and where can I get one? Capricorns don't like talking about their feelings but every now and then they need to be reminded that you love them and everything is okay. You take a group picture and hate it. Result of overthinking, creating problems that initially did not exist. I want what you have got. To astonish me by it. Is something till I find something better. Two hours ago. I am one of those melodramatic fools. Neurotic to the bone, no doubt about it. Zero replies, zero retweets, zero favorites. Reply. Ambulance had to be called cause I had a panic attack after watching too much intense Grey's Anatomy. This would literally only happen to me. If I don't find a date to formal pretty soon here I might actually go into a full blown panic. Ha ha, moving to Myrtle Beach. Bye.